Welcome back, Wowsery. Today I thought I'd do the uh, Road of Worship Satsuma. It's a 20 inch gun monster. So we'll see here. I'm going to use a super battleship hull. And I'm going to max it out. 28 and a half knots. Don't care about the range. I'll give it mini oil. I'm gonna need that. And add some of that stuff right there. I'm gonna go with the tower two. And this I don't think that's quite center. Move it back. Hmm. Hard to tell. Uh, try that right there. Go with the huge, because I am doing 18 inch guns, I mean 20 inch guns. Got to leave a little bit of room in between here. Really wish I could use that funnel, but it won't let me because the game is selfish. I'm going to use the tall one right here. Doesn't quite get the whole entire, like the game, on this one. There's actually room for two of the uh, five inch guns but can't do that with this one so have to kind of fudge it and go with that right there And secondary guns. It had four twin 203 millimeter guns. And I think I can place them one right there, one right there. And it does say 14 100 millimeter uh, twin turrets, but I don't think I can get 14 on here. Two. So one, one, two, three. Whoops, one too many. Get rid of that one. Really? Yeah. There we go. And now for this, got to crep four, do barbet three, torpedo four. Let's go with a triple. Haven't done a triple before. Hopefully, I'm not going to run out of tonnage here. Okay. Doing millimeter because that's what it was, and I was too lazy to swap it into inches. Edges are very lightly protected. The Cunning Tower has a lot of armor. 
I've actually gotten to where when I design ships now in World of Warships, I mean, uh, in Ultimate Admirals and Rule of Waves, I kind of don't look at it's an area where I can take tonnage off. Okay. And here is my Satsuma. It's called a Kagi, but uh, let's change that. I think I spelled that right. And uh, let's hop into the battle here, see what the battle we have going. Uh, I am on YouTube, bit shoot. Come on over, like, subscribe, share, leave a comment. Let's see what do we have? Uh, small battleship. Katsurugi. Looks like a carrier name right there. Got a North Carolina vibe going on. 457. What is that? 19 inch. 505. 510. 500 something. 20 so yeah maybe somewhere in there my conversions not going too well here at the moment <laughs> let's see Some of my secondaries are in range already. And they're hitting. Let's see. Green, red. Only bad thing about these ships is they, they take forever to turn. Their turning arc is horrible. Seventeen kilometers away. Just me, or were those shells that splashed when I was over here looking? Had a weird angle in. Maybe not. I don't know. Incoming shells. Nope. Oh, there's a hit. It was a big hit. Let's see. Stern belt, extended penetration, mid belt. Hmm. Man, they just keep hitting me. 21 hits. You know, it seems like these guys haven't barely, have barely turned. Two engines, 
steering, the rudder's gone. Forty one per cent, forty two per cent. There's another hit. I'm getting hit. And let's see. No, it doesn't actually say the percentage. There's another hit. And another one. Main gun destroyed. Well, that could have caused a flash fire. Gone boom. Eyes are really, really dry. Should have done some eye drops before doing this. Oh, there's another hit. Ricochet. Worships, I've actually played with the ship once. Oh, the ricochet. I can't really say. Well, it's a tier 10 ship, and I'm not a big fan of World of Worships tier 10 play. I think it's quite honestly horrible. These guys are just taking forever to turn. Let's see, what if I went that way? And once again, they're just slowly grinding. I mean, it's a slow grind. Secondary guns are out of range. This one, secondary guns, is 178. Is probably 7 inch. Oh, they're probably six. This is probably 18 inch guns, not 19. Incoming. It's about 50, bl 50 millimeters below. Was it 2.54 centimeters per inch? So that'd be about 25 millimeters per inch, roughly. Ooh. Just hanging on. The Oklahoma. Standard. I mean, it's all or all red, just about everywhere. 1% superstructure. And that was it. And the other one's Michigan. So 18 inch guns, yeah, no. They can do some damage at this range. Although the 20 inch guns are doing much more. Let's see, it's got, it's got sonar too. <laughs> I didn't put sonar on mine. 
Man, that was a massive hit. Standard reloading. Let's see how long. They reload rate of fire 0.7 rounds a minute versus 1.08 rounds a minute. So they have one more gun, but they sure just don't make up for it in round rate of fire. Incoming. Let's see, 93.85. He's already down to 58. He's only been hit seven times. Let's see, the battleship cost $102 million versus 238 million. We got some flooding going on. Should lose an engine without flooding, really. But it won't. Actually, the, the ship itself gives me a. I think it's a South Dakota class vibe. Not squat. For the longest I didn't like it and then I was revisiting the design and was like, no, oh, it's actually a really nice looking design. Look at all that fire. And put out the fires. Another fire burning. And look at that, all that fire right there. These fire crews are working extra hard. Man, they're just... Trying to make a turn. Hey! 336, more flooding, all right. Uh, I think my secondary guns are now back in action. What is this, B-20? 20-knot battleship? For 1940s? That kind of sucks. Thirty-two, forty-five, yeah. Those twenty-inch guns are definitely wrecking havoc. Even more havoc. Oh, I knocked out one of his guns. So that's gone. He's down to six guns and really not gonna make it. Well, they had some firepower. I don't think they had the armor or the speed or the rate of fire. All hurt the computer design. But let me know what you thought. Liked it, didn't like it. And I'll see you next video.